6 and 10. To whom shall I speak and give warning, that they may hear? Behold, their ear is uncircumcised, and they cannot hearken. Behold, the word of the Lord is unto them, a reproach they have no delight in. So the Most High said, you guys' heart and your ears is uncircumcised, and his words are a reproach unto you, which you have no delight in. That's why you guys come out and us saying that we're speaking and preaching hate. And hate speech, we're preaching the words of the Most High Spirit and the truth. Now the proof that uh, 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 Yeramya is part of those uh, four spirits that the Most High trapped in the river Euphrates. After this book was done, he told Baruch to throw it where? In the river Euphrates. And, the, and no, no, nobody went into the Euphrates to actually get the book. The book came back spiritually through Ezra's. And the Most High in Revelation says what? Unleash the four spirits that's trapped in the river, what? Euphrates. So these words, the only person that could release it was who? Who unlo unlocked the seals? Yahweh Shah. Therefore, if you don't receive these words, the way we're giving it to you, the way the Yahweh Ba'asham Yahweh Shai told us to give it to you, you're not going to receive salvation, no matter how many times you do your little parades. Your parades ain't, it's, it's for nothing. Go ahead, keep going. Therefore, I am full of the fury of the Lord. Therefore, I am full of the fury of the Lord. So us being upset and mad is, a, is justified by the Lord. Keep going. I am weary with holding in. Mm -hmm. I will pour it out upon the children abroad. Now, aren't you weary from withholding in all this information? Because I damn show it. That's why we're out here. Because we're tired of it. All other people, they're not tired of it. But his children are tired of it. The 144,000. Keep going. And upon the assembly of young men together, for even the husband with the wife shall be taken, the age with him that is full of days, and their houses shall be turned unto others, huh. with their fields and wives together. Mosiah says that even the husbands and wives shall be taken, which goes to the scripture, every, every house apart and their wives apart, man. Which means when you go into these concentration camps, and I don't give a shit if you married onto that woman. That woman's gonna go over here, that man's going over here, that child's going over there. It, and they, matter of fact, they did that to my aunt because they was looking for a house. And because they didn't have a kid, they had to go, they said that they would have to go to do two different uh, uh, homes, basically, until they found a house. Because mm -hmm. they had no kids to go. And they married, legally. It don't matter. Remember, they'll, they'll, they'll uh, uh, suppress a man in his heritage, man. Even a man in his house and his heritage. Keep going. And uh, for, from the least of them, even unto the greatest of them, everyone is given to courage, courage. And from the prophet unto the priest, everyone daily falsely. So from the greatest of us to the least of us, that means the oldest man and woman to the youngest man, a little baby man and woman little girl, all right? All of us, as their what? Covetedness? Co covetedness. Which means what? You always want something that you as you know you're not supposed to have, something that belongs to somebody else. You quickly, ah, oh, let me just go ahead and take it, he ain't gonna notice. All right, from the oldest to the young, man. Why? Because the, young, the old ones are teaching the young ones how to do it, man. Keeping that chain going. Go ahead. They have healed also the hurt of the daughter of my people, slightly saying peace, peace, when there is no peace. When there is no peace. So all these people are hurting the daughters of our people saying peace, peace, when there is no peace. The Most High said there is no peace. Yahweh Shai said, I came not to send peace on earth, but a sword. Yahweh says that I am a man of war. 